Welcome to the Florida vlog. So I thought I'd start it with a bang, literally with a bang. We're about to watch a rocket go off. It honestly, I have goosebumps. I cannot believe we're about to watch a rocket go off. Um, so the rocket is is quite far, but you have to stand far away back. And also, we went to the Space Kennedy said the Kennedy Space Center yesterday, and. Um, we went and explored it all. So now having learned all about it, it's like incredible to watch it go off. Um, this is obviously not a rocket with people in, as I've learned yesterday. It's not going to the moon, as I learned yesterday. It is going up, it's like a satellite, I think. Yeah, anyway, it's incredible what's going up to space and we're about to watch it. Apparently sometimes it comes over your head. I'm gonna zoom in and see if you can see it, but. Okay, so beach, rocket. Okay, zooming in. So that's in the distance, let me move my finger so it will focus, and that is going to go, shh, I might film it on my phone, I feel like it might be a little bit better. But we have had, is that my phone? Sorry, my phone is playing some kind of music. Okay, so we have been to this Kennedy Space Centre, we went for an outlet shopping day, but I haven't really vlogged because I've had to get loads of content for iPhone. iPhone for Instagram and TikTok and everything, so I'm going to vlog from now on because we're changing hotels today. We're going to Universal tomorrow and yeah, it's just a really fun next few days, so I'm going to keep you updated. But for now, we're going to go watch a rocket launch to space. You're probably wondering why the next clip is not the rocket launching. So. As per most rocket launches, as I've learned this trip, they don't normally go off on the time they say. So we came back to our room because we've got to check out today because we're moving hotel. So the rocket should be going off in about 30 minutes. So I quickly came back, did a quick change because we're going to Icon Park today. And then we're going to run down to the beach, watch a launch and then head to Icon Park. So I'm actually here on a work trip with Tui, which is just incredible. It's been the best trip so far. We're only day... It's Wednesday. So the trip ends on Saturday. Um, but yeah, it's been amazing. I'm here with four other, five five other content creators and then two girls from Tui. And they're all so lovely. I didn't know them before I came out, so I was a little bit nervous to come, but it was, it's just been amazing. Anyway, I'm gonna show you my outfit for today. And then we're gonna go down to the beach and watch the rocket launch. Show you through here, maybe that, mm, actually I'll go to the log mirror. My bag is ready to go. Um, So we have got a little top from, Hollister is a little bit cold today because it's cloudy so I went for a long sleeve top and then this is from super dry a little white skirt and then I've got my converse on and then I've got a black rucksack um but yeah very excited and I will keep you updated on the rocket launching right we're all on the beach we're all ready to go three minutes 40 seconds <laughs> I'm gonna film my reaction on here and then I'm gonna impose the video from my iPhone on here I think that will be better I think that's the best way to show you both both views two five seconds <laughs> oh my gosh I might cry <laughs> Oh my god, you can hear. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. my goodness. It's well, see, now, now, above now you can As see the tempo at work. Yeah. 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 I can't believe you've just seen that so and now much. it's above us. Uh, 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 we're in there. Yeah. Wow. So we have arrived at Icon Park, which is like a park that, not with like loads of theme ride, theme park rides. Um, it's basically a place you can, if you just want to spend a few hours somewhere, if you've got a bit of time to go before your flight or you can't check into your hotel yet, it's like basically right next to Universal. And I've never heard of it, so it's very cool. And um, we've been for lunch at Uncle Julio's. Um, and we had fajitas, we had a, um, What's it, like a chocolate piñata? It was delicious. And now we're about to head on the big wheel. It's kind of like the London Eye, but in Florida. Um, it takes 20 minutes to go around, it goes really slow. But yeah, very exciting, very lovely to see. Still not used to um, America's aircon. You go in, it's freezing, you come out spoiling, you're never in a good temperature, but we love it. Um, this is here, we're entering the wheel. Kate's vlog, hello. hello. We're going up on the wheel. The wheel! It's basically at the London Eye, it but is. it's come all the way in Florida. All to Florida. Florida. Here we go. It's like going up in a gondola up the mountain. We're all going together. We're all going in the same one? Yep. Amazing. Here we go. Oh, there is a little bit. Whoa! Yeah, that's great. Hey, he's not sure. You're right. Yeah. And then right behind that is Icon Park that you can see there. Oh, Bay. 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 Oh,
me over the no, 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 no. <laughs> Over there. Okay, so we're off the rail. Uh, the wheel? The rail? The wheel. Um, I need to edit that out. That's my home address. Um, but they've got this postcard to send home, so I'm going to send it to Matt. And I'm going to put it in here and send it home. Hello, everybody. I think I've got a smudge on my camera. Let me just have a little... There we go. That should be okay. I feel like whenever I look at the lens, I'm like, that needs clean. Anyway, I've just had a shower. We have made it to Orlando, staying in a Universal Studios hotel. Never done that. How incredible. And we're having dinner tonight in Universal Studios on this village walk, city walk. Anyway, lovely, lovely to be here. We just had a nice chill hour, as in we just got to chill in our rooms. Um, and we've got probably about another hour until dinner, so I'm gonna get ready. Um, let me give you a little room tour. Just slightly unpacked, not really. You come in there, lovely flooring. Just had a shower in there, then the bathroom there and then there's two double beds i love america i feel like this always happens because it's like children that come and stay so i've just kind of laid my clothes out there my bed's going to be there capitan luke has come all the way with me to keep me company and then this is the view i'm on the second floor and you can kind of see the water there so if you get a boat from here it goes all the way around into universal so we'll do that i think for dinner and also Tomorrow I'm going to go to Universal. So I'm going to get ready for dinner. I'll show you what I'm wearing. Don't know what I'm going for yet. Um, and yeah, it's actually Yaya's birthday tomorrow. He's part of the, um, he's one of one of the two that do hand luggage only. And they're so lovely, honestly, incredible. If you don't follow them, they do some great travel trips. And it's his birthday tomorrow. So I think we're going to go do a big, big evening tomorrow night to celebrate his birthday. But yeah. I will see you when I'm ready for dinner. I'm ready for dinner and I'm gonna do you a little OOTD. So this top is, Amy gave it to me because it was too big for her, she's tiny. Um, Pepper Mayo, it's like a little corset top. I've got the new Girls Who merch on, which hasn't launched yet, but this is the jumper because the air conditioning, like I said earlier, is so cold. So when you're sitting in dinner, you're like freezing. So I always take a jumper with me. And then let me show you in the long length mirror. I have got some white linen trousers on because again, it gets cold. I want my legs covered. Um, lovely lighting, really spotlight. And then this bag is from Mango. And then I've got my trainers on. We've just, Kayla's <laughs> getting the consent. And we've just hopped on the boat to dinner. How stunning, that's our hotel. And off we go. I'm with Kayla just for the vlog. Um, What's the hotel called? Sapphire Falls. Sapphire Falls. Sapphire Falls. Falls. I thought you said Flores. I was like, okay, Sapphire Falls. Yeah, and um, it's one of the closest hotels to Universal. It's in the Universal Resort. to film before I ate, that's really unaesthetic. But I got the vegetable rolls I was and the Philly rolls. The camera didn't eat first, I did, you know. And we've got a tree hugger there. Yeah. Have you tried that yet? No, not yet. Not yet, but it looks lovely. Mm. colouring on that. Sarah, what did you get? A high class. Hey Billy, hey Billy, that looks like delicious. Okay, what we got over there? Oh, sorry, I really <laughs> So I got a veggie roll and I'm also sharing the tree hugger but I've got my brand new white top on. So, so she's really giggly say. <laughs> Tony up. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Guys, while, while Tony is finishing her mouthful, we've been calling Tonya Tonya the whole trip. And only today we've realised it's Tonya. And you didn't correct us that whole time. Huh? What? Yeah, the only <laughs> You're what? joking. <laughs> what? No, you're no, you're joking. No, her name's not Tonya. She told us today her name is not Tonya. 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 Oh my gosh, I think calling you Tonya. <laughs> yeah. Why are you just saying things to me? I even questioned you earlier on about your you. own name. <laughs> Like, this is what happens when you come on a trip with strangers. Oh you feel God. too awkward to, to say your name. Good morning. The last you would have seen is us at dinner and us finding out that Tonya's name is not Tonya. It's Tonya. Honestly, going on a trip with strangers, you find out a lot and you realise you're saying people's names wrong. Yeah. Um, anyway, we're about to head to Universal. It is 
Thursday morning. Um, so last night at like 4 a.m. my alarm was going brr, 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 and also I did not set a 4 a.m. alarm and my work phone was going off as well. I picked up my phone and it said like new emergency alarm test and I was like I swear in London it's not meant to go off till Sunday and so I just put my phone to sleep I was like I must have not read that it changed times. It was the Florida emergency test. Florida emergency testing at 4 a.m. What's going on there? Not sure. Anyway, I'm gonna give you a little OOTD. I'm quite naked because it's gonna be hot and I kind of just wanna run around the park and not have anything on me and not take a shirt or anything. But when we're in aircon at lunch, I'm gonna be freezing. So this is a little set from Nasty Gal last year and I love it. It's so cute, um, but I do look quite naked, but that's okay. Um, and then I'm gonna bring some sunnies and my Uniqlo bag because I fit so much in and it's so easy to um, take with me. Anyway, wish me luck. I've still got a headache from last night, which is really annoying. I thought it would have gone, but I've taken some paracetamol, I'm gonna grab some breakfast and then hopefully all will be okay and the rides will just distract me. Um, I will probably just vlog on my phone because I don't wanna take this camera on all the rides and in the park, just in case I get it gets lost or something happens to it. So I will be vlogging on my phone and take you along to Universal Studios VIP tour for the day. So excited. Brecky got banana and um, mm. banana and strawberry smoothie yeah, and then I had a croissant and some water and everyone else has got their smoothies in the back. <laughs> so this is where we get the boat from our hotel. Our hotel's literally there. Go through security here and jump on the boat to Universal. How excited are we out of 10? Very excited. Oh, out of 10. 100. It's a 10 out of 10. It's a 10 out of 10. I feel like Kate's a um, professional at Universal. I feel like you know everything about it. I do feel like I've got some tips and tricks. And what's your favourite ride? Um, I'm actually really looking forward to Harry Potter this time. See, I haven't seen Harry Potter. The last time I was here was when I was 15, so. So there was no Harry Potter. There was no Harry Potter. <gasps> what an exciting day for Bronte. And then you get to ride on his broomstick. <laughs> <laughs> on Harry's broomstick. On Harry's. And Dumbledore's um, um, motorbike. motorbike. Yeah. Wow. Hello. <laughs> Okay, really bad quality, but we're the first um, on the ET ride for today, and they check you in with an ET passport, and you have to put your name in, and names come up that people have. Um, if like, another Bronte's been on before, then it'll come up. If another Lloyd's been on before, then it'll come up. There's never been another Bronte in the whole world. This ride has been here for 20 years that has ridden the ET ride. I'm the first ever Bronte to ride the ET ride. Right, we're in the VIP area of the Men in Black ride. This is mad, we're like behind the scenes. Got the aliens there. And we're about to go on the Men in Black ride. This is madness. Until we can choose a wand by Tui, which is very kind and very exciting. I, I don't know why I'm drawn to this one. Apparently we need an interactive one. Ooh. So we're just about to board the Hogwarts Express. I've got a lemon aid slushy full of sugar, but I need to pick me up. We're in the queue, ready to go. Lunch is served. We're in this lovely restaurant. Oh, lovely. Ms. Ava Hatter, should I put that down here? Thank you. Restaurant, and we're literally looking out. Awful, awful iPhone. I need to get a new one. Looking out onto that roller coaster, which we're going on after, and also another one there. Okay, I don't know when I last filmed, but we've been on so many rides. I really put my brave hat on this morning, and we went on the fastest and scariest roller coaster in Universal, and I did it. It's called Velocicoaster Coaster. I'm in Jurassic World and oh my gosh, I don't know if I'm gonna get copyright for all this music going on, but honestly, it's so good. I think we're ending the day on two more and then home. I'm back on the camera and I'm back in the hotel room and I'm back from Universal Studios as well. Our hotel's in Universal Studios, so I'm not really back from Universal Studios, but I'm back from the theme park. I am shattered, but it was absolutely incredible. I'm so proud of myself for being so brave. <laughs> Some of those theme park rides were intense. We had the VIP tour, which was just a once in a lifetime opportunity. Our guide was amazing. She was called Ali. And oh my goodness, I just had a 10 minute nap. I think it was like 10, 15 minute nap. And I was like, I could sleep the rest of the night, but we're going out for dinner. I've just got ready for dinner, had a shower. Um, I actually came back with some voodoo donuts. They're incredible. I got the Captain O Captain one, which is like a cereal one. So good. And then a cookies and cream one. 
delicious. What? Just what were you doing? Oh, I was doing it around the dinner table. Do you think I'll get copyright for this music? Yeah. Do you it think? It's on YouTube. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to get copyright, but basically I wanted to go around the table and get everyone that I'm on the trip with to introduce... <laughs> oh, talk really quickly. Talk over the music. Um, to introduce himself and yeah, I'll do it once we're in a place with no copyright. <laughs> I can do it now. Um, we've got um, ice cream from... Cold Stone. Cold Stone. So and we was... went for the birthday cake right <laughs> That's our most Haley and I sharing. That was lovely. We got a few um, marshies on top, didn't we? Delicious. Delicious. What did you get, Sarah? I also got the bread cake. Oh Remix. my god! Oh Remix. my god! <laughs> so basically, it's a cake batter ice cream. Yeah. Chocolate fudge sauce. Nice. Cake pieces and sprinkles. Oh, you got the pancake pieces though, didn't you? The what? Did you get a pancake? <laughs> Wait, lemon pancake. <laughs> You said lemon pancake, I think. Yeah, yeah. No. Yellow pancake. Yeah. Oh. I thought we were getting yellow pancake. Lemon pancake. Oh my word. No, no. Yellow pound cake. No wonder you went for brownie. Yeah. Brownie. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
American sweets and I also just want some for myself. So I got her all of these. Yum, 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 yum. Full of e-colors and sugars and everything. And this Nerds Bite. I also got these. Um, I've seen them somewhere and I just wanted to try them and I think they'll be nice for snack for the plane home and I can share them around on the plane home. I got this for Ray for when my niece for when she comes and stays. I just thought very cute and it's plastic so it doesn't matter if she drops it. These ice cube trays, um, I just thought nice for the new house. Love some stars. Um, some more cotton pads because I've run out. Some scrunchies because that's the only way I keep my hair up. Okay, I got these and I know they're for men. Now I've tried them on, they're men's, but it doesn't matter. When I'm running, I get so many like flies in my eyes and also it's so bright. <sighs> Do you know what? We're gonna go with it. We're just gonna go with it. Um, I got some claw clips. These really cute flower ones. I mean, just some plain ones. I got some thongs because I've run out on this trip and I needed some more. Reese's Pieces stuff for my sister and Matt. I got myself a banana because I was hungry. We're on the phone because my battery just ran out, so that's good. I also got myself a eyebrow pencil. Um, it was cheaper than in England and I always use this one from NYX. I also got that eyebrow glue. Now, I don't know how it is, but I just thought I'd give it a go. I love brow honey, but I just wanted to give another one a go. And I got some stuff for Ray, my niece, again. Um, how cute is that? She's going to Dubai with my sister and also she's coming to Croatia. So I just thought these are so easy to put on. Um, that was a nice little trip out. I love Walmart. It's basically Asda, but I still love it. Eat my banana, need to wash my hair and get ready for our, this is our last dinner. Get ready for our last dinner. Apparently we're doing karaoke because we didn't do it last night because we were all too tired. So we're apparently doing karaoke tonight. Good morning everybody from Universal City Walk. I think that's what it's called. Been here so many times I should know. We have just arrived for breakfast at the Chocolate Emporium. Um, we're gonna be a very sugary breakfast, but I thought to myself, do you know what? Gonna get the last sugar fix and then we're ready to go. Um, packed all my bags up. This is my breakfast. I got berries and cream waffle and a cookie, cookie jar milkshake. Delicious. We have just finished breakfast, which was delicious, but do you know what? I never finish sweet things, so I got maybe two bites into the waffle and I was like, it's a lot, but it was delicious. It's a very cool place to go, actually. I think it's loosely based on Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. That's what I'm getting. Um, but now we're just walking back to get to the boat, which is, that we're literally in Universal. That is the um, thing to get in. Service in the background. Um, that is the gate to get in. So now leaving this to then get on the plane home, it's very sad, but it's been such a lovely trip. We've absolutely loved it.